And welcome, by the way. Well, as I said, Tungstein, um, Congress is in theory a pretty good ship. It is a pretty good ship, but it's nowhere near consistent as Alaska. Good. Let's go. Let's show the world that Kabarovsk still matters. <laughs> By not going into the cap, though, that would be suicidal of the ship. I like German ships. Nice. Then I recommend the Schlieffen line, the Z-52 line. <coughs> nah, actually I recommend all lines, but Schlieffen is the best line of... And Schlieffen and Elbing are the best lines of the German tech tree. GK is okay. Z-52 is okay, Hindi is also okay. But Elbing and Schlieffen are great. <laughs> I love Hindi. I like, like Hindi a lot as well, but it truly suffers sometimes from matchmaking, depending on what you fight. <coughs> it's a great ship, but if you have like a lot of high caliber beasts, it's like nowhere near as fun. How about Pommern? Pommern is not a good ship, in my opinion. I don't like it. I don't like it at all, even. I think it's one of the worst tier 9s. But there's a lot of opinions about it where people like, like it, but I don't. It relies way too much on the secondary armament. AG is way better, yeah. Because in the end, besides the Schlieffen line, main main armament should always be the most important factor. Can we get a fire instantly? Oh, Mr. Stalingrad! <laughs> yeah. Hello. Time to get annoyed by a billion shells. Who are you? This guy that whoever is there is a bit annoying. He shoots pretty fast. Eight guns. No idea what it could be though. Do you aim, aim directly on the target? Anticipates. Depending on you need to anticipate it. If it goes fast, you need to lead more. If you got and then it depends on your shells. If they're slow, fast. You have to always delete your shots. Of course, if somebody stands still, you directly aim on him. But yeah. Like this guy, he's barely moving, so I'm very gaming on him pretty much. But there's a lot of fast ships, we need to give a lot of lead. Damage bond. That means he repaired his fire, so if you get a new fire now, it's gonna stick on him for a bit. Burn now. Can we get another one? That's the number fire. Let's go. You always want to focus the D's if possible because they're the main threat in a way that they can decide games quite well. And they can disengage way easier. So that's why I'm switching on him instead of going for the battleship. Forward again. If any good point for the Pommern. Mm. I can't recommend it for myself. I can't. The main guns are trash. Your secondaries are good, but the main guns are pretty trash. So I can't recommend it. I'm sorry. 
It does have a lot of survivability, but then again, you can can, pun can get punished if you show broadside anyway. Yes, I can show you the Kaba Captain after this battle. Much obliged, Commander. <laughs> this is, by the way, gunboat DDs, so my consumer is terrible in this case, pro. And not wondering that I don't fight for the caps, because then I would get spotted and shot to pieces. There are gunboat DDs with way better conceive and you can fight with caps still. And you always, with this ship for example, you want to adjust your speed so people miss and you really want to like constantly arrest them. <coughs> As you can see, most of the time I'm actually spotted while shooting. But I use my insane speed to dodge the shells and like reverse go forward. Now here for example I break fully. Dodge the shells. You can go now full speed again. Now I go full speed again, and you will miss again. Keep reversing. No 69k damage, one kill. Let's go. Let's go, boys. Remember when Kaba could do this back in the day while we remained unspotted? Oh, yeah. The times where Kaba was actually beyond busted. I remember those times. Dissipated it, right? <laughs> Problem solved. How do you build Prince Rupert? Full secondary build. Oh, that's great, so we're not even detected, even better for us. <coughs> I'll show I'll show you build, Kazarin. I'll show you build after this one as well. Oh, 
Oh, that Hindi has no engine anymore. That's unfortunate. Gotta watch out about the Southern Rod. He will eventually shoot me. some AP on this city because you shouldn't put broadside. Okay, damage one, let's switch again. Hey glue fuel by the way. What do you think about Clausewitz? It's a it's a good ship. Uh, it's it's a great tier eleven. Let's say like this. Unfortunately there's things like Condi and Annapolis which make it look rather weak but it's still good. The problem is in comparison to these two, it's of course it's pretty weak. That's the problem. If you compare them to Annapolis and, Klaus, uh, and Condi, it's pretty darn weak. If you don't compare it to them and look at as a chip alone, oh god, that was a bad move. Um, it is pretty solid. It's not a bad trip, it's just the other two are way better. Okay, good. Let's move forward. Keep keep going with our gun mode, boys. finished yet What's the best tier 8 currently for the moons? I have no idea which ones are available at the moment. There's only one left, and then we got it. And then I'll show you the modules pro. And the Kava builds and the Prince Rupesh build. You get all the stuff, boys. Just be a bit patient. The game is nearly one.
<laughs> that was great. That was absolutely freaking fantastic. <laughs> Das ist faktisch ein Kreuzer. Ja, faktisch eine Ballerbude, as we would say in German. Eine richtige Ballerbude. Not the easiest to play anymore, and there are way better gunboats like Muscle or Kleber, but. or Ragnar. But it doesn't matter, you can still use it. Not too bad, 145. It's okay. But didn't play copper in a long time as well. Third in the place. Yeah, let's go. GG. Good. Pro, I still here. Hans, welcome back. Welcome back, my friends. So, Pro, I still here. Okay, what else do we have? Um. Can you show me a captain build for the car? But this is my captain builds. Full gunboat. And for the modules, you want to go with the legendary mod because it gives you more range and better reload. You drop concealment, but you just want to have the extra range because otherwise, Kaba doesn't have a good range. Good. Um, then, what was the next one? Prince Ruprecht build. I'll show you my Schliefen because you technically build it the same. Let me just check my sleeve. <laughs> yeah, this this is the build you want to go. You want to have concealment and secondaries. And, really important, IFA3, so you pen 32 millimeters. Good. So, um, other than that, you want... What was the last question? Oh, pro! Pro! Yeah, you said you're level 2, right? Let's go to a level 2 ship real quick. I'll give you a quick introduction of the game. <clears throat> so, let's just take... Let's just take the Dres. It's a T2 ship. If you, if you go on equipment... You have a mo modular slot here. There you can put in something, like for example... Your main guns don't break that easily, so we do that. That's how you can upgrade the ship. Then you have things like here... Which you get with like XP when you play the game, you unlock a better hole, which makes the ship a bit stronger. You can also get this, which is um, better firing range. And then, then you have here a commander. Do we have a bad commander that we can put on? Him? Yeah, let's just put on Star Scream on him. Why not? Good. And this is the commander. A commander, you can also skill perks. Like, for example, you want to switch the 